LLG elections have been deferred twice already, once in March and then in April. While different reasons were stated for the deferrals, the underlining issue was funding. The Electoral Commissioner in March, while providing an update of LLG election preparations, stated that the Commission needed money to deliver elections. When elections were not conducted as scheduled in March, but deferred to April, sources inside the Office of the Electoral Commissioner confirmed that funding constraints have led to the deferral. When April came, it was further deferred to September. The Electoral Commissioner, in his statement dated Tuesday, 13th August, confirmed the dates for the LLG elections, however indicated that they would need the balance of 108.9 million kina to do this. The government had budgeted 160.9 million kina for this exercise. From this, only 52 million kina was released and has been used for electoral roll verification and update for over 370 LLGs across the country. The outstanding 108.9 million kina is money that will be needed to conduct the elections. Electoral Commissioner Simon Sinai said the Interdepartmental Election Committee, or IDEC, met on August 12th and discussed a way forward for the LLG elections and the outstanding by-elections. The committee, comprising of lead agencies like the Department of PM and NEC, Finance, Treasury, Department of Justice and Attorney General, Police and Defense, agreed to look for the balance of the funding, which is 108.9 million kina required to conduct the LLG elections. Meantime, Sinai said for the pending by-elections for the open seats of Paila Pogra, Day Council, Aitapelumi and Usinobundi, the Commission needs to look for funding to conduct these by-elections as early as next year. Ruth Rungola, TV1 News.